Is silver the new black? More and more women are saying goodbye to dye and hello to their natural silver hair color. It was automatically known as being older, that a light had gone out in a way or something, but then Clairol came along <laughs> and then we started to color and hide everyone's uh, natural color. Lorraine Massey, a stylist and author of Silver Hair, is on a mission to launch a new movement to inspire women to let their natural hair shine through. You're not letting yourself go, that's for sure. You're just letting go of the idea of being silver. 35-year-old Andrea Fishkin started to see silver strands peek through when she was just 12 years old. I felt that maybe there was something wrong with me, like why am I graying so early in my life? Hair goes gray when color-producing cells stop producing pigment. Scientists don't know exactly why some people go gray early, but genes play a large role. After 12 years of dyeing her hair, Fishkin decided to accept her silver tresses. I get compliments every day. Sometimes I'm almost just like, okay, enough. <laughs> it just really makes me who I am. You know, it, it, it's, I, I love the brightness of it. I, you know, I think it just matches me really well. Celebrities like Jamie Lee Curtis and Helen Mirren were some of the first to go full silver, but young girls like Pink and Lady Gaga have followed suit. We're talking about now, for the last five years, this silver trend has been going on, and I'm amazed at how many women actually look really great with silver hair. 51-year-old Dana Guerrero wanted to follow the silver movement and came to Massey for help. It'll definitely take a little while for me to get used to it. I'm anticipating that um, because I think it'll be a little radical today, but I'm open to the experience. There are a few ways women can embrace their naturally changing shade. You can quit dyeing your hair cold turkey. Start adding highlights or lowlights for a smoother tone transition. Begin growing out your color from underneath. Or for women like Dana with short hair, you can dye your hair silver. So I'm gonna bleach it up as light as I can, um, but then we're gonna tone it after that. So that's when we're gonna put the silver tone on. Massey says going silver is also good for your wallet. Women who go to the salon at least every six weeks to cover up their grays could save around $1,000 a year by going natural. After a few hours in the chair, Dana is ready to see her transformation. Dana? Yes? Are you ready? I'm, I'm ready. Turn you around. Okay. Okay. Oh, holy. Oh, my God. <laughs> no swear. I know. Oh, my goodness. I Honestly, even, yeah, you, I don't even know who this is. I don't know what to think. I mean, it's beautiful. I love it. It's such a change that I, I'm, I can't speak now. I mean, I never am at a loss for words. Would you do it again if you had to? Oh, totally. Time? There's something real deep going on here. Okay. Yeah. It's like a, I don't know. Massey says going silver isn't just about style or saving time and money at the salon. It's about the desire for authenticity and the freedom to be oneself.